District 58's goal is to provide an outstanding education for all of our students in pre-K through eighth grade and also to support our staff to make sure that they can deliver that high quality education. High quality facilities lead to high quality instruction. When you don't have high quality facilities, it forces teachers to pivot in many directions in many areas that are less than ideal to deliver that education that our students deserve and our community expects. District 58 has so many facility needs, first and foremost because of our neighborhood school model. When you have 11 elementary schools and two middle schools, you are gonna have a significant amount of facility needs. We haven't been able to successfully pass a referendum that comprehensively addresses all 13 of our schools since really the early 1950s. District 58 is tax capped, meaning that we are very limited in the non-referendum debt that we can issue. And what that really means is that we're limited in what we can spend and put towards facility needs. Several years ago, the district set out to develop a strategic plan. And as part of that strategic plan, they developed a master facility plan. The facility plan in District 58 addresses three key areas. First and foremost, maintenance and renovation of our equipment in our facilities. Another key area is safety and health. The last area is making our middle schools true middle schools. Right now we're one of only two districts in the DuPage County that has uh, K through six elementary schools. Now we're starting to talk with the community uh, about those needs and, and how we can get those done and ultimately that may uh, require us to go out uh, to referendum. Obviously we, we want to make sure we get a lot of community input on that. It's really, really important. District 58, in my opinion, is a great example of how to be a wonderful steward of taxpayer dollars. In my entire career, I have never seen a district do so much with so very little. We have done everything possible to make sure that we have our fiscal house in order before we go and ask the taxpayers to support a potential referendum. Despite all of those measures, it still won't be enough to do what we need to do in all of our buildings to bring them up to code and to make sure that we can continue to offer the best educational opportunities for our students and staff. One of the wonderful things about living in District 58 is our low tax rate. District 58 takes pride that we have the lowest tax rate of any large elementary school district in the county. Even if a potential referendum was passed to provide these updates to our school, we're proud to share with our community that District 58 would still have the lowest tax rate of any large elementary school district in DuPage County.